Okay, we have the engine turned over, and we're just going to remove this oil pan. Just use a rubber mallet. Knock it loose. Now we have access to our main bearing caps and our rod bearing caps. Uh, now's when you want to uh, match mark your caps to your rods. But I've had this engine, this bottom end apart once to replace these main and rod bearings, so I already have these match marked. Now the rod nuts, 14 millimeter, 12 point. Okay, now we're ready to remove our uh, piston. Let's take the end of the hammer here, just tap on the studs, we'll pop it free. Just like that. Take the cap. There's a rod bearing. Make sure the uh, studs don't scratch the crank. Whenever you're moving the pistons, I find it real easy for them to come out if you just coat the whole inner cylinder with uh, oil. So. Here's our rod, one of our rod bearings. So you can see that that looks pretty good yet. So if these bearings are in good condition, I may just end up reusing them. Okay, just continue pushing on these studs. And there's our piston. First pin feels good. This bearing is also in good condition yet. And basically you just repeat the process for all these. Alright, thank you for watching.